Hey there guys, and once again, welcome back to more adventures in Minecraft. This shoutout goes to Deradical Larry, one of my uh, very good viewers. And by good, I mean uh, not well behaved, but a uh, regular viewer, I guess I should say. Uh, I don't know if he's well behaved or not, actually. He may be a very bad boy, but uh, shoutout goes to you, Deradical Larry, so thank you for watching. Um, today we are going back in... <sighs> these saves. Uh, mean people, Jake, space... I actually have other people playing on this computer. A lot younger kids. I guess that I'll save that story for another time. Um, you'll notice I've made a few changes. I got Brownie home into the stable. I added a couple things. He has water now so we can be happy. And I built just a little door in there as well. I also uh, made myself a new set of armor in the last episode that wasn't recorded again. Because you know why? Because everything failed. Everything failed. But this episode is not going to be a failure. Because if you see it, it's not a failure. Um. Uh, let's see. I guess I also made a golden apple with my gold. It's over here. So I used eight blocks of gold to do that. And I guess that's pretty much about it. Oh yeah, and I uh, traded my normal axe to a villager for three emeralds for an efficiency two axe. Seemed like a good trade at the time. Anyway, uh, you may be hearing some more ma-ing than usual coming from the basement, and that's because JJ is down here, and he wasn't before, but he is now because he's so awesome. So, hello, JJ. I'm glad you're back. I went out and got him. Uh, Mo Creatures reset. I had to re go get all my pets. They all escaped, every single stinking one of them, and I had to go get them all. So, um, yeah, don't tell me we're going to lag all the way through this. JJ, see? Now that's completely random. Completely random. There was no planning that. Um, let's see. And it's still gonna lag all the way through it, isn't it? Yes, it is. I'm, I'm gonna do that because I'm... I'm... I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lag. Alright, I'll be back in just a second when I fix that. Alright, the sun is setting now, so I do believe it's a perfect time to discuss what I'm going to be doing. In this episode, you'll notice I have two Chemical X bottles here. And you know why that is? Because this episode, we're going to need a boss fight. And some of the most epic boss fights come from Chemical Xs. Or, th at least that's the way it should have been said. I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Anyway, uh, we're going to go out there when it strikes night. The, when the clock strikes midnight. We are going to go out there and absolutely use this on a zombie. And we're going to see what it gives us. And hopefully it'll be a pretty epic battle. I'm really, really hoping that it's an epic battle. Uh, we'll have to look for some zombies to spawn. Uh, Got to go look for other things to do first as well. I guess, uh, yeah, we're going to have to wait just a little while. Now the moon is starting to come up. But I want to chop down just one tree. Just one, Oh, no. Not you. Okay, we got to get this guy out of the way. He has a diamond block. That's good enough for me. Uh, we might as well make this like a double featurette boss fight. This guy and the another guy. The another guy. Yeah, all he is is the another guy. Oh, not you. Not yet. Not yet. Wait. Can't take on both at once. Um, I'm going to try to get right into the his core here. And uh, break that open and hurt him. Like I, I do. I, I love to hurt people. Uh, that's one of my favorite pastimes, actually, if you didn't know that about me. But, um, how am I poisoned? Oh. You. I did not want to see you right now, right that at that minute. Come on! What is wrong with you? Why can't I kill you? I should be able to kill anybody I want to kill in my life. It's just one of those things that I should be able to do. I mean, if I want to do it. There's no problem with that. I'm going to drink a regen potion right here. He's regening, so why can't I? I have every right to regen. Um, Come on, this guy has a diamond block, so if you get him down, we're good. We're doing really good if we get him. Oh, no, here it goes, here it goes. Kablamo! There's the diamond block. That's exactly what we wanted. All right. Let's take the sand scale out and get a diamond block. Actually, we'll take the feather out. Sand scales are kind of valuable. Um, All right, that's that. So we've got a diamond block now. And um, there's a zombie over there. First of all, I know he's a little bit too near to that tree. I was going to talk about cutting down a tree. But I guess uh, I still have a story to tell about that. Actually, once, uh, when I was walking down the street, just minding my own business, like like with that rich walk, even though I'm not rich, I pretend to be rich sometimes. I just walk like that. That's just how I walk. Anyway, um, I was walking down the street like that. 
there's this tree by this house. There's a utility crews working all around this house on the power lines and other places like that. So I'm like, yeah, this is perfectly normal. This happens all the time. Then, uh, there's this huge tree, you know, like I said before. And this tree didn't look like a threat, but it was like right over the house. It's like, I'm talking a 50 foot tall, like three foot thick trunk. Not even joking here. This tree snaps. Absolutely snaps and comes crashing down on the house. Busts open its roof. I'm not even joking. And we're like uh, 50 feet away from this. 30 feet maybe. I don't even know. But we're really close to it. And we're just like, what? And the utility crews are just like looking at it. They're like, we didn't do that. No, we didn't do that. Uh, but that's just... It, it was weird. They didn't do it. They weren't anywhere near the tree. Although I thought they might have had something to do with it at first. But nobody was in the house. Nobody got hurt. It was just... The tree just snapped for no reason. Came down on the house. I'm not telling a story. It actually happened. Alright, this Mr. Zombie here. What? Wait a second. I notice your face. You're Carl Frankfurt. Trying to sell me your products again. I don't want to buy, Carl. I don't want to buy. But I do want to give you a taste of this. Hits him directly. Starting to get hurt. We don't know what's happening. What's happening to him? He, he died. Um, that wasn't supposed to happen. Alright, this is Carl Frankfurt. That was his brother. I uh, this is actually Carl Frankfurt. <laughs> come on. That's not funny. How come this isn't working? Sorry for cheating. I do apologize deeply from my heart. But that should have been working. What? I don't even know. Alright, uh, let's try that again. And hopefully... No, that's kind of a bad place, you guys. That's kind of a... No, no, I don't want to be a part of your shovel social group. Shovel social group. Where people get together and talk about shovels. Not really big fan of that. Don't really want to be a part of that at all. Sounds kind of boring to me. If, if you ask me, it sounds just a little boring. I don't even know. Maybe it's not. Maybe some people find joy out of that. I personally do not. Uh, I'm going to try this on you, bro. Hiya! That's the real Carl Frankfurt. Nobody else. But he's the real Carl. Oh no, he's on a horse! He blew up. Alright, you know what? Fourth time is a charm. That's what my grandmother's mother, his mother always told my father. Because she didn't know he, she was gonna, he was going to marry her granddaughter. She always used to tell him fourth time is a charm. And, uh... I have a messed up family. <laughs> No, that didn't actually happen. I don't think fourth time is a charm. Because Carl Frankfurt has died three times now. Can't get him to spawn. Uh, what? Alright, let's try Creeper. You know what, Gerald? Gerald? What's this? What's this, Gerald? What are you Are you trying to absolutely spawn? What are you doing? What are you doing, Gerald? Oh, come on. What? It says this thing has a 50% chance of working. I want my money back. This does not have a 50% chance of working. It has like a 0% chance. Oh. Come back here, Mr. Chemical X says. I need to delete you. This does not even make sense in the least. I don't even know what's going on. Here's another creeper. Gerald. Try this on for size. You better not try that. Better not do that on for size. Gerald. Oh, Mr. Gerald. Why do you do this to me? Stop that! Uh, Gerald! I thought we were friends. I thought we were friends. You know, I, I thought we are friends. You know what? I have a signed certificate from you saying we're friends, but you, you didn't believe it. I don't I don't even know why. Hey! Get out of my way. Gerald! Stop it! We killed Gerald. And I totally did not scream like a little girl, no matter how much that sounded like it. Um. Hmm. Interesting. <gasps> what? I thought I would get something for this. I killed Gerald and I got nothing. What is wrong with the world today? 
I mean, if you're gonna go to the trouble of killing somebody, you might as well get some kind of reward. Doesn't that just seem right? I mean, we got moral values. Kill somebody. Some reward, dude. Just some reward. I'm not asking much. Just for something little. Maybe. Just a simple trinket. To show that they care. Instead of just destroying, absolutely destroying, and having no simple trinket. I don't know. All I know is that uh, this is going to be... Hey, Carl! Hey, Carl's brother! What's this? Oh, yeah, what is this? I think he's going to die. He's going to blow up. Yep, he's going to blow up. It's not even funny. It's not funny when people blow up, actually. Contrary to popular belief, that's not very funny. Not the funniest thing I've ever seen. All right, time for a bow snipe. This is not even funny, so I'm just going to take you all out. Oh, one by one. There they- Oh, what? You gonna be defiant, bro? What's this? You think you're gonna be all that- You think you're gonna be a gangsta? Think I'm like- I don't have to listen to anybody. I'm gonna be a gangsta. I'm gangsta. No, you're not, bro. Being gangster doesn't make you awesome. Alright, uh- No! Don't you dare blow up next to my house. I will murder you. And your family! Boom! How did you- all right, that's it. I'm gonna hit you with my. Ha <laughs> ha! I feel so evil doing that. How did you? What? Uh. All right, I'm going to. I'm gonna try to find another zombie. We are going to fight the mutant zombie, no matter what you think. You may think we're not. You may think I'm telling high tales. But I'm not. I did have to burp. That was a double burp. Wasn't my fault. You can't help double burps. Alright, uh, here is what I've been looking for. These three guys over here. The Carl Frankfurt Brigade. Uh, these guys think that they're all that, but they're really not. So um, I'm going to slow this guy down a little bit. So I'm going to get a good shot on all three of them. Boom! Take a picture together. Boom, take a pic- Oh, come on! What? Neither of those worked? Ah! <gasps> uh, it did work! Alright, hi bro, how's it going? Carl Frankfurt. I, I, no. You- you don't understand. I was- I was good to you in your childhood years. You know what? I- I never said anything bad about you in front of your friends! Don't get near my house, bro. I just had that shirt! Man, you can smash the ground, like, really hard, bro. No, get out! No, no. What?! Oh! Epic battle through the air! You don't even need music. I've got this. I got this. DJ is like, you need music, Flash? No, I got this, DJ! I got this! My music is on my own! Well, bang! Right in the tummy. Tummy. Is that a little kid word? I don't even know. Uh, no, no, no! I said, get away! I'm not a fan of you! Retreating deeper into the cave. Can he get away? No, he kind of cannot. This is bad. Flash smash! Oh no. Oh no. I need flint and steel. He's gonna revive himself. He gets up. He's at 40 HP again. Oh no. Destroyed flash. Flash uh, smash. Light him on fire. Here we go. No, he's getting back up. Flash up. No, he's back. He's gonna kill me. Help. Carl! <sighs> Light him on fire, here we go. Look at this. Hulk Hammer! Ow! That hurt my ear. Hulk Hammer, that's what I'm talking about. We killed Carl Frankfurt and got the Hulk Hammer. That's Carl Frankfurt on a bad day, you guys. I told you you didn't want to see him on a bad day. You guys wouldn't believe me. Look, I'm eating scorpion stuff now. All these textures are getting messed up. Come back to apologize, Carl. Sorry. I'm not going to accept it. You tried to destroy my homeland. Indian brave say no destroy homeland. For pale face zombie. Or maybe green face zombie. I don't know. I don't know what all these colors are. I didn't learn the colors correctly. How am I supposed to know? I'm gonna close the doors. Close the doors. Nobody in this place. 
We got the whole camera. We're putting that away. We're framing it. It's our gonna be our favorite. We could frame that actually. You know what? You were framed. You're on candy camera. <laughs> um let's see. I think this is how you make a frame. Leather in the middle. Yep. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Alright, uh I think that we can get this out now. It's time to come out, Mr. Hall Camera. All right, there's our framed Hall Camera. You know, in that uh, Cracker Barrel, where they have like uh, rusty old machinery hanging over your head and uh, boats and things that should not be on the roof. Well, Hall Cameras shouldn't really be on the wall or on the roof either. But when people come to eat in my restaurant, they're gonna say, "Hey, look at that! This guy is strong. He got a Hall Camera. He beat that guy. He beat a Hall Camera. He, he did it." Because old ladies always come to my restaurant. I have to just push them out sometimes. You know, when people get to be a problem, like they start pushing out the old ladies. Well, in my restaurant, uh, the old ladies start pushing out the people. And it's a big problem. So I have to really tell those old ladies off. Uh, it causes major trouble. I get half the business because teenagers, gangs of teenagers, they're afraid to come because of the rowdy grandmothers. And, sorry, that's just the way it goes. Uh, well, we got the whole camera in this episode. That was kind of the point. Uh, look at... You know what? I was, I was gonna show them. Children's cancer? Children's cancer is calling on the phone? Oh, I don't want to talk to them, really. Uh, uh, children's cancer is a bad thing. Why would anybody want to talk to children's cancer? I don't even know. Uh, it's it's probably just a telemarketer, you know, ad, like, saying children's cancer. Can you pick it up? You're like, I want to help with children's cancer. And they're like, hey, do you want to buy a hamburger? Uh, not really, bro. Um, anyway, what back to what I was showing you. This is my Minecraft t-shirt right here, bro. Mm, that's power. Yeah, I'm wearing it because I wear it all the time now. I wear it like 24, 8, not 7, 8. Because there was eight days of the week. There's one day called Flash Day that lasts for a millisecond. Uh, nobody knows about it yet. Gonna become very famous soon. Hi. Right. So celebrate Flash Day. Hashtag Flash Day. Um, I think this was a pretty productive episode. So we got like a hall camera, bro. In the next episode, I want you guys to leave comments on what I should do. Because... I like things to do. I th I'm thinking of going to the end pretty quick here. It's not going to be the end of the series, but I've got to... Somebody just jumped on my head. Don't know who it was. Don't you hate it when that happens? Somebody jumps on your head. It's those rowdy grandmas again, I tell you. Uh, anyway, uh, I've got a lot of ender pearls. I'm thinking of using them. Got a lot of blaze powder. We have got quite enough everything to go around. And I think I'm going to the end. I mean, that wouldn't hurt anything. Uh, I think it'll be actually a pretty good decision. So, uh, my camera is running out of battery and recording space, and I'm running out of voice. So, uh, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching, and should I do the blah thing like I do? Blah! Let me try that again. I didn't quite do that correctly. That's right. One, two, three. Blah! I made a flimsy steel, guys. We're gonna head into the nether in this episode. Hi guys, this is Super Lewis 64 here, and... Let's play our Let's Plays. We're doing it backwards for some odd reason, because he thought he could handle the intro. I, I can't handle the intro. I've made 200 in some of them. I've made like 300 and stuff, so I am the Well, well, well. Well. You know what? what? We're friends, so it doesn't matter.